God damn. Well, I hope Paul made it. We had such hopes for you and your brother. It would seem you are not as loyal as we expected. Loyalty to what Simons and agents like you have made of you, Natco? I would rather die. We are thinking the same thought. It's him! Target acquired. <laughs> I came to watch you die. You're early. I've got at least 20 hours left. I was hoping the kill switch would have started. I don't feel anything. You won't be able to hide it for long. What have you done with Paul? Same as anything that malfunctions. Same as you. Okay, I'm ready. All right, I'm out. Now what? Guys moving around. All right. Well, hello, children of the internet. It is I, Foggy Senor, and welcome once again to Let's Play Deus Ex. In the previous episode, we transmitted a distress signal for the NSF for our brother Paul. Went back to the apartment where he was suffering from the effects of the kill switch that's now been activated on us as well, and. Unatco raided the area, and, uh, oh my yeah, god, fuck it. Nope, there's not. There's definitely nothing. You're full of shit, sir. That's right, you just keep walking. Walk along and do your thing. Um... Yeah, and we've got- and then we got- we ended up here. Ooh. Anna Navara confronted us at the train station, threw us up in here, wherever this is. It kind of looks like UNATCO headquarters, which we've been to before. Combat knife. I don't think I need it. Riot prod though, I will take that. Lieutenant Jackson, a failed intrusion attempt into LabNet has unfortunately scrambled other key systems. Most of the security grid to be reset until the grid is fully restored. The detention block door code has been reset to 4089, while all detention cells have been reset to 4679. You will be notified when the situation has been fully resolved. Agent Sherman. Four six seven nine, eh? There's a med bot in there. I want that. Four six seven nine. Yeah, we got banged up pretty bad fighting our way out of Paul's apartment at the Tan Hotel. Get healed up here. And, uh,. All right, there's stuff in there. Four, six, seven, nine. Gets us the access we need. Some soy food. Excellent. Hey, there's an alive guy in this one. Surely he won't be an en enemy to me since we're both locked up in here. Yeah. You're the spy they caught, right? I never worked for the NSF, but my brother did. I think he was captured too. You're definitely not the only prisoner. I heard noises down the hall. Good. Maybe I can find him. Let's get out of here. I smuggled in a knife and a med kit, too. You want the med kit? 
Yeah, I'll take the med kit. What do you say? I think we can make it. Uh, I'm not sure how I want to handle this. Just slip Just out, slip. guy. I'll handle the guards. Well, all right. Let's see. Let's watch how he slips. Miguel. Miguel is his name. Multi tool. All right. Uh, not much of note in that one. 10 millimeter ammo though for for moi coming from that. Okay, there's a camera. We're gonna have to get around that. Run, 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 run. Got it. Well, I don't know who's helping us, but they've got a lot of information and they seem to want only the best for me, so I'm going to not question it. I'm just going to do what they say, follow along their advice. Now, they said that my stuff is in the armory to the south, so I think that's where I want to go first before we do any of this other crap. I need my stuff or I won't be able to efficiently navigate this facility. Or deal with any guards or resistance. You are beneath the nanotech lab. Well, that's not precisely where I wanted to be, Mr. Whatever you're called. They said something about an armory to the south. Can you point me that way? I know that's south, obviously, but... How do I get there? That's the real question at the end of the day. I guess I could try going this way. Do are there any paths that bend southways? The command center, eh? Open this and poke my head out. Oh. Plenty of people hanging out near the command center. Definitely somewhere. No, it's not. God damn it, can you go down? Can you go down on the ladder? Fucking idiot. God damn, I hate ladders. Yep, nerves. All right, quickly grab this guy. There's windows all over. Trying to hear if any alarms are going off. Don't think anybody's seen me. Looks safe. How about a quick save, eh? How about a real save? before anything else. Secret MJ-12 facility. It's not so secret if I know what it's called. Assault rifles. I could try shooting my way out of all this, but... seem to be a lot of dudes, and they're way... better equipped than the NSF ever were. Gas grenade, though. I'm gonna take that. Take that, business. We could always use gas grenades. Okay, that's the labs. Oh, somebody's seen me. I hear the music. I hear the music of death. No, that's not the one. That's not the one. That's not the one. That's not the one. I don't find it particularly fair that I don't have 360 degrees of fucking vision 
to goddamn not have this sort of thing happen to me. But I'm not gonna fuck. I'm just not gonna complain about it. I don't have to. Okay, well, I've knocked out a dog. I guess that's a thing. God damn, but if this isn't the most annoying shit. No, there will be nothing here now. There will be nothing here ever. You dumb, dummy, dumb, dipshit, stupid pants. I hate these guys. Okay, there's our guy. That's the guy I'm targeting next. Just so you guys are with me. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Never mind, now this guy decided to show up. Hey, stop right there. That's the one. Oh. Never mind, never mind. I gotta knock all the guys out. Let's start with that. I've gotta come knock all the guys out. I gotta figure out how to knock all the guys out first. Or kill them, or whatever. I gotta do that first. That's objective numero uno in this place. You need to get rid of all the guys. Every fucking one, because it's just windows. It's just windows and guys. Okay, perfect. Save. Swing back this way. Detention, that's where I came from. Good to know the armory is nice and easy to find. Fucker. These guys are sinking their damn patrols so I can't ever goddamn get close to the bitch. Ah. Do you guys just once want to be not fucking right next to a goddamn each other? Please. Could you try that one time for me? Oh my good god fucking piss damn it. Fuck. Where's the other guy? He goes in a big circle around the bottom. We'll wait for him to do his damned circle around the bottom then. Just poke my head around. Here we go. We'll do it this way. Other guy won't be able to see me because he just covers that corner or that side or whatever. Fucking nonsense. Except he's probably, yep, he's coming down that way. Hit this guy quick.
Okay. So, okay, Sergeant Asshole went all the goddamn way around. Come on with your ass, Mr. Dog. Come get what's coming to you, fuck. Cut your ass into a million fucking pieces. Now I'll travel in a circle. A big fucking... I'm gonna save. Travel in a nice circle all the way around the room. Follow old ass clown there. Wait till he start... Did he seriously see me? He turned like he fucking saw me. Which I'm gonna call absolute fucking bullshit on that too. God damn this fucking stealth goddamn fucking nonsense. It's even worse in revision, by the way. I've only mentioned that revision one time, but holy fuck is it ever not Remember the briefing. He's down. Let's try to get an <laughs> This is the part where I grab the radio and say, Oh, we're all good up here. How are you doing? Command Central's doing just fine. No, no. The cameras are supposed to be off. Don't worry about it. Quick save. Quick save like I've never quick saved in my goddamn life before. Now, we're coming back along this direction. I'm going this way. I'm gonna go back the way I came. Detention center. Robot maintenance. Yeah, this leads south. So I could have, I could have avoided all of that if I just turned fucking right when I came out of here instead of bothering with this dumb shit and trying to be all smart. Ooh, I'll go under the floor. Surely there's gonna be guards around. Hey, did you think about the floor won't take you where you need to go? The armory is to the south, on the opposite side of the main chamber. Okay, well... Let me worry about getting to the armory, then. Of course there's a million dudes around. Should I? Should I try to do- Nope. Here's the- here's what happens when you try to do the smart thing. You didn't think about that there's a million dudes up fucking stairs, too. Let's listen to Daedalus explain what we're- where we're at again. This is the maintenance facility for the security robots. The armory is to the south on the opposite side of the main chamber. Hey, I know that because I've come through here one time already, and I failed because some guy saw half of my fucking arm over the top of a crate and beneath an overhang. Okay, no ID. Aim for the head.
Hey Martin, there's been some kind of security snafu, so all the codes have been changed until further notice. Blanket orders from a new guy I haven't seen before, an agent of some sort. The new armory code is 2971, but don't let that get around. I just want wanted you to have access in case the bots get twitchy again. That last OS upgrade seemed a bit shaky, and that makes me nervous when applied to walking gun platforms. Okay, 2971, is that what it was? Whatever, it goes into my log. I don't need to m memorize things. Well, I'm glad I took the time. Good computer. 'Electromagnetic grenades. We'll go ahead and take them. We'll go ahead and quick save. We're going to be quick saving often, I think, in this area. Now that I've goddamn got a goddamn fucking foothold on the place, hacked into Command Central and the robot room. Fucking Christ. Security. Nothing. They got nothing. Bot AI alteration. I don't know what that did. Oh, good. They're now shooting the, uh, the NSF. Or sorry, not. Ha! Huh. NSF aren't the bad guys anymore, dummy. MJ-12. Is that what they are? What does this button do? Oh, it lowers the lift. Well, he's on the upper platform, so it don't really matter at this point. Uh, what do you got? Nothing. There's soda, though. Okay, what do we got here? Janine's bot specs and overview. Page Bravo 3 Peace Bringer. The Page Industries Bravo 3 Peace Bringer is an affordable security and patrol bot that combines a bipedal frame with an air-cooled minigun that utilizes the 60 se or sorry, the 762 by 51 millimeter NATO round. While the AI is limited in its capacity, or sorry, capabilities, it is more than adequate to the needs of most security and many military forces around the world. Having been deployed in such troubled hotspots as Hong Kong, Chicago, New York, Buenos Aires, New Delhi, Moscow, and Paris, like almost all bots designed to maneuver in urban environments, the Bravo 3 employs a radar imaging system for situational awareness, but unlike previous models in the Peacebringer line in the uh, in the Peacebringer line, the Bravo 3 is now equipped with a Razorthorn signal processor for target acquisition. Organizations or facilities in need of heavier bot armament often turn to the larger Delta II Peacebringer, equipped with thicker armor and missiles. Okay. 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 I still don't know what any of that really means, but it's, uh, it's interesting nonetheless. Now let's make our way back downstairs through the pile of unconscious and dead bodies that I, uh, fucked over with my baton, riot prod, and hackifyingly altered death bots. See? Look at this nice guy over here, nice and dead. 
take his sniper from him. Not that I need it. I'll just drop that. I don't need your sniper, buddy. Old buddy, old pal. I do need to recharge my bioelectric energy, though. That is something I can do. And I can save the game quickly with a quick save. Uh, will these fire at me or do anything? No, they just kind of sit there. Multi-tools, can never have too many of those, unless it's more than 20, then the game considers it too many. Alright, we're making our way to the other end of the room, supposedly that's where our armory is located. And that is where all our stuff is gonna be, which is mainly what I'm worried about. Getting my stuff. What is that guy's patrol route? Okay. I want to take him out, but I don't want to alarm any of these goddamn maintenance men. Because apparently they go running if you threaten any of their hostage takers. Alright, bioelectric cells, grenades, and crap. Is there stuff over here? Doesn't look like it. Uh, it also looks like we've basically cleared this room of any threats that would come after me for making noise. So, explore a little more. What do you got for me? Get out of the way. We have enough to worry about. Trouble with the bots? Of course. Just look. Only one is operational, and now it's malfunctioning. Maybe somebody hacked the security system and tinkered with its programming. I think it was you. You don't exactly blend in, okay? I think you're the one they caught, and now you're trying to escape. So, you gonna sound the alarm? Maybe we can swing a deal, huh? You want the security login? 500 credits. I also have 7.62mm ammo for 600. But what about an accuracy weapon mod? 750. I'll check back with you later. The only thing I was considering out of the things he offered me was the accuracy weapon mod, and I'm thinking, man, I get plenty of those. Anyway, who gives a shit about buying that for 750 credits? I'll take my chances with 80% accuracy and laser sights. Alright, there's a bot botting around. But this does appear to be the armory. Which is what we need. Now, did we get... We did get the code to the armory. I've forgotten it. 2971. Okay. Here we go. It's probably this thing in the middle. 2, 9, 7, and 1. Sure looks like an armory to me. Oh. What is he doing? Oh. Alright, we gotta get in. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck. Fuck that shit. Alright, let's get this thing ready. Never mind. Let's... I'd rather take that guy out in here. Alright, let's go under the camera and get up the stairs. No, I haven't. I found the room where it's in, maybe. Alright, security terminal. This is what we need the most. Hack it. Deactivate the bots. Armory bots offline. Camera offline. Alright, that should be everything that we can do with that terminal. Excellent. 
throw down a quick save. And we'll come back down the stairs here. Ah. Here's our... Resident Armory nerd. Give him a little bit of prod. Prod him, prod him in the face. Grab him and toss him off that way. Alright, now I want to take a look outside and make sure there aren't any more guards. Walking about. It seems clear. It seems like they put one guard and some armory and the bots to protect this armory. I guess it makes sense. Not anymore, though. I've proven that that's not an effective uh, security measure. Anyway, we're going to hack into this. Uh, well, let's not. We, we might find the code for it. We'll come back to that. Um... We are gonna get all our stuff back, though. Here's my sniper rifle. My scramble grenades, my camo, hazmat suits, classic, all the stuff we need. Here's my stealth pistol. I missed it, missed it so much. Pick this up. Jump on it. I want all my things back, please. Pepper gun, hell yeah, hell yeah. Toss, take, ah. Uh. Oh, I can only carry one baton. Well, I don't want the one that I, I want my old one. Give me my real baton. All right, lock picks, cells, gas grenades. Why is it too heavy to lift? Why, what is, okay. Bullshit. Got my medical kits back. Got my multi tools. Hazmat suits. Soy food. Like, why can't I pick up these multi tools now? Okay, let's try dropping the ones that I already have. That might do it. There we go. It wouldn't pick it up because it's a stack of 20. Am I missing anything else? This looks close to what I had before. Drop this. I never had one of these. Or a knife. I don't carry that. Drag this up. Drag this up. Drag this up. Uh, this can come down. That can go here. These hazmat suits. Put this like here, this here, this here, this here. I don't know. It's probably everything that I had. Probably. It's not safe to assume, but it seems like it was all just kind of sitting on these two rows of shelves. Now, I did see some interesting looking crap upstairs that I want to explore further. They have all kinds of- yeah, look at this. Ammo for everything! What are you missing? Come get it up here. Silencer! Fuck yes! That's what we needed. Where's the silencer? We're gonna stick that bitch right on that sniper rifle there. Oh yeah. And range. What do we need more range on? I, put, I usually put them on the stealth pistol, and that'll be the case here today as well. Stealth pistol, I've got the max range, accurate range, up to 180 feet now. That's nice. And then there's whatever that is. Hmm. One tool to get in. You know what? There's multi-tools downstairs. Let's see. Plasma rifle. I don't have I don't even have enough room for it. Sounds like something I couldn't handle anyway. I'm more of a low-tech guy. This is clearly some sort of prototype. 
Alright. Well, let me grab my restock on my multi-tools. Let's get my belt organized. And uh, while we're doing that, we can uh, start wrapping up here. So, um... In the next episode, we are going to take our reacquired equipment and, um... We will... Use it to find Paul, I guess. This Daedalus thing that's contacting me says that, that Paul uh, is still alive and somewhere in the laboratories or something like that. So we need to get out there and uh, save him before he gets killed. We don't want him to get killed. So we'll go save Paul in the next episode. Uh, I don't know. Is there anything else? I don't think so. So look forward to all of that. Until next time, I have been Foggy Senor. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. And... Ciao now.